All right, so you come in here. So I got the new carpet. Uh, got storage underneath there. This folds into almost almost a queen size bed. Uh, curtains or new curtains that I've been made for them. They're almost pretty much like a blackout. As you can see, they're pretty dark. Uh, got your electric heater there. Uh, these doors, I replaced the, the other ones are falling apart. So replaced with these little slide doors. Uh, oh, here's the brand new fridge. Those are those drawers that I just put the uh, wallpaper on them. Uh, stove, everything stove here. Uh, this is for the uh, furnace, but the furnace doesn't work. Like I told you, here's the gas. Uh, are the, for the water heater. Here's one closet there. The water heater's underneath there. All right, as we continue, uh, so here's the other closet. It's got a bunch of drawers in there for storage. Like I said, the closets haven't been redone yet. Uh, so, and then here's the bathroom. So you have your toilet there. Your shower pan is a little dirty because it's just been sitting. Um, and then there's the shower. Here, handle here. You know, you know what I was saying? You could, you could put something up here to, to hold it down where it just waterfall. I know you had talked about doing some kind of curtain. Maybe you could probably turn these, turn this light sideways and put a rod here if you wanted to make a shower curtain there so it doesn't go on that direction of water. Um, here is the closet in there. It's got your some plumbing, all your shutoff valves in there. Uh, it goes right over there to the west where the battery and the inverter and stuff in there is. Uh, then down underneath there, can't open it up right now. Pull all the drawers up. That's where your shutoff valve. But down here is for the uh, for the sink. And there's oh down here I can show you. More. There's the inverter. That's still original, but it still works. So that's what I'm looking at. Um, 